has to be the brightest spot in Assumption Parish. This holiday season, it's also where a man has realized his boyhood dreams. I love this story. It's, it's a place where you can help thousands of other kids have their dreams come true. Here's Alan Toomey's Toomey's Travels. Merry Christmas! What could be warmer than Santa's smile? Or brighter than the nearly two million lights in Ray Daigle's yard? Only one thing, the Christmas love and joy that Ray spreads across Pankerville every year with his huge display. This year, there's a little something extra for Ray. His dream to have a working Polar Express in the yard. Oh, I love a choo-choo, especially when it smokes and all, and you, and you, you see the train going around the track. And you think of it as a child, when you were a child, and you think of the dreams that you had as a child. And you bring them to life. And now uh, I brought a train to my life, a big train, not a small one, but a big one. <laughs> Everybody's welcome to share Ray's joy. And once again, the U.S. Marines are here. Looking at the lights is free, but Ray would like you to bring a new unwrapped toy for Toys for Tots. The key thing is, is to no kid left behind. Uh, the thing we want to do is, is give a toy to uh, children that don't necessarily have the chance or the monetary value to, to, buy, uh, to buy toys. This year, more than most, with our economic woes, the toys are badly needed. You can visit Ray's Lights on LA-1, just south of where it crosses Highway 70. In Pankerville, Alan Toomey, WAFB 9 News. The lights are on from 5.15 until 10 o'clock every night. Santa greets the kids every Friday and Saturday from 6 until 8. Now, each year in the past, we have asked what the light bill was for this whole thing for Mr. Daigle, but this year, I think probably we were afraid to ask. Don't want to look. Doesn't his laugh sound like Santa's, too? What a neat thing. Good night. <laughs>